Hi and good morning. Today I'm going to be doing my nails with a semi-cured gel. This is from Dashing Diva and they need a UV lamp. I've never tried these before. I'm pretty excited. So since it's a first time, I decided to try the clearance. They're only $5 at Walmart because they're Halloween themed. They're normally $12.97 and I found that that's a normal price between $11 and $15 at Ulta, Target, Walmart, CVS. So you know, check out the clearance because you never know what you'll find and see if you like the product. But today I'm going to be trying this for the first time. So stick around and watch. I decided to go with the Witchful Thinking Kit and I have my UV lamp right here as well. Kit includes 34 semi-cured gel nail strips. And because it's Halloween themed, I have some beautiful purples with with bats and black with bats and some orange swirls and sparkly purple. The kit also comes with the instructions, two prep pads, a nail file, and an orange stick, a very small orange stick. So the instructions say to wash and dry your hands and shape your nails and then push back your cuticles with the orange stick. I've done that already, so the next step is going to be to clean your nails with the prep pad. The prep pads smell like they're just rubbing alcohol, so if you run out of these because two isn't enough, then you can just use rubbing alcohol. Step two is to select your size. Hold the sheet over nail to find your size. If you are in between sizes, always size down. I selected the sizes I want. As you can see, my nails are different lengths. This one is particularly short, this one is long, and these three are in between. And this is so I can know if these are good for all different lengths of nails. The next step is to remove the strip from the sheet starting at the edge and place the strip over the center of your nail starting at the cuticle line and pressing outward. The next step is to remove the protective film and then to press down. Now we need to trim the excess with either nail scissors or nail clippers and using the orange stick just to smooth out all the edges. Next step is to set the timer for 45 seconds to cure the nail. The next step is to just file a nice sweeping motion in one direction across the edge of the nail. Now I'm going to follow the same process with the remaining nails and I'll check back in when I'm done. all done and it didn't take too long to apply all of the nails and it was really fun and easy to get a hang of. It was my first time so there's a few little things I need to practice and get better at like sizing and cutting down any nail sticker that is a bit too wide because they're not going to fit your nails perfectly. I did mention that my nails are different length and that would help with the review if you have very short nails, medium or a very long nail. These two nails they fit perfectly so that length it was the exact size I didn't have to cut my nail which I really didn't want to do I added an extra top coat and the reason why I did that was to seal the edging near the cuticle and then the edging where my nail is really long because it's my first time I know that some of these parts are going to lift up quite easier so adding the top coat will really help with making sure that you have a little bit more of a seal I did not cure the the top coat because it's not that kind since I'm right hand dominant it was easier to cut my left nails this strip with a scissor but it was not easy to do that with my left hand so I had a clipper for cutting the right side the other thing I figured out pretty quickly was to curve the sticker and I was pressing the edges to curve it instead of just pushing it down that helped it stick on the sides a little bit better I wish I figured that out first thing but I'll know for the next time I try these nails I have the white kit and I'm really excited to use those. But I did have fun playing with them. I flipped them around. There's a lighter side at one side and darker on the other and I flipped that so it was a little bit of a mix. If you have a free moment, I recommend checking out my video of three easy steps on how to grow and strengthen your nails. I'll pop it up on the screen now.